In this video, I'm going to show you how you can create a list of the names of the worksheets in an Excel workbook. I was doing, doing some work for someone this week, and he was in the sports industry. And my experience with individual sports is that you're, um, the coaches or representatives are sitting sitting down, and here's your list of competitors at the bottom here, and the order of go is always changing around. And so you think, oh, maybe he can go here, and they can go there, and eh, how about there? And it changes all the time just because of dynamics of the sport or whatever they're doing. So what we need to do is these are each individual people and we need to have a call list that they can update at any time. And so I wrote a little macro for this. So now as a coach, I'm happy with my, uh, my list of my order of go here. And so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to my macros. And I'm going to go order by sheet tab and I'm going to run it. And now you're going to get the call list of all the order of all the people as they appear in your um, in your list. Now, um, I was misunderstood originally the, what, what the task was. And I thought that what he wanted to do was he wanted to create the list on this sheet and then he wanted to change the order of the tabs the other, going the other way. So I wrote two macros here. So let's just, um, so I'm going to put Mary over here. And I'm going to put Eden at the beginning. And so now I'll go back to my call list. And now I'm going to go run another macro. And I'm going to go sort by list. So I'm going to sort these sheet tabs what I have on the list here and so I'm going to run this and as you can see the order has changed instantly so I, I can show you both macros so this is um, the first one which is rather a, a simple what it's doing is it's creating a list of all the sheet tabs and so um, R is row and R equals one and for each worksheet in in the sheet in the workbook basically it's going sheet one cells r1 select and sheet one r r1 which is this right here right is equal to worksheet name so that's why it's putting the name in there and then i increase the row to go down to the next row and then i go to the next worksheet and that's pretty simple code okay so let me show you what the other one looks like so for the other one sort by list um, R is row, I as long, R equals one, and with sheet call list, that's where we are here, um, error resume next, and for I equals range, um, I've got a width going here, so that's why I'm doing I range A and rows count, um, rows count end up, so it's going down to the bottom, and then going, uh, going back up to step negative one, sheet cells dot sheet dot cells i1 value dot move before sheet one next i arrow on arrow go next and, and width so that's how you sh you sort the sheet tabs according to your list and the other one is how to create a list of your sheet tabs i will include both of this um i will include both of these scripts in the description of my video. Please subscribe.